Hello friends, in this module we are going to understand about the infrastructure, economic infrastructure and the social infrastructure. Whenever any business needs to grow, infrastructure is the basic requirement for any business because if I want to get some goods, if I want to develop some goods, I need basic infrastructure for rapid industrialization, movement of goods, movement of people, infrastructure becomes very important. Now, what do you mean by infrastructure? Infrastructure is not just limited to building, bridges and all these things. Infrastructure is a very wide term. Infrastructure is very important for socio-economic development of any region. Now what do you mean by socio-economic development? If a person needs to develop socially or economically, infrastructure plays a very vital role. So basically infrastructure can be divided or classified into further two ways economic infrastructure and social infrastructure. In this module we will be understanding about economic infrastructure. Now what is economic infrastructure? Any infrastructure that is made to uplift the economical value of the country is nothing but economic infrastructure. What are the measures taken by government to improve the economic infrastructure? The very first measure that is taken by government is electrification in rural areas. Government is trying to provide electricity to maximum everybody possible. So government is trying major effort so that everybody has proper electricity and a lot of different activities can be conducted. Apart from that, government is also trying to increase the level of electricity generation. As the population is increasing, the need for the requirement for electricity is also increasing. Therefore, what needs to be done is the Therefore, what needs to be done is increase the production of electricity. Government is working towards that. Also, government is trying to build more and more roads. For this purpose, government has made efforts to build roads. For example, 3.37 lakh kilometers of roads were built. That is a huge amount of roads are built. These roads are built so that the places could actually connect and there is regional connectivity between different places. Apart from that, government is providing a lot of different services. Government has also started metro projects in Mumbai and Nagpur. We can already see the metro works have already been started and metros have also started in certain areas of Mumbai. So government is also building metros. Apart from that, government is building ports. Ports are also very important as Maharashtra is covered by Arabian Sea on one side. So a lot of water transport is happening. So government wants to increase the ports so that the trade through water transport can also be increased. Apart from that, we all live in the world of internet. We all use Instagram, Facebook and Twitter and a lot of different apps. Over here, what happens is in Maharashtra alone, we have 5.45 crore internet users, which is the highest in any other state. Over here, that means we have a large amount of people having access to internet, which is a great thing. But what do you mean by this? That means government also needs to reach to the other half of population who does not have access to the internet. Government is trying to increase the base of internet amongst them. Apart from that, government is basically trying to increase the regional connectivity. So this comes under economic infrastructure. Thank you.